Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Dianca. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for continuing to watch. If you are new to my channel, please take a second to hit that subscribe button. Today I am coming to you with two unboxings from Chanel. So if you're interested in seeing what those are, then please keep watching. Okay guys, so it's been a minute since I uploaded my last video, but we're going to just jump right back into the swing of things. And the first item that I have from you is from the Chanel Color Codes collection. So with that being said, you probably already know what's inside of here, but let's go ahead and open it up. Now this actually came out during the summer months, so I purchased this probably back in maybe June or July. I just have not used it or opened it. So we're going to get right into it. And this is what it looks like on the inside. And let's open it up and see what we have. And this here is the Chanel Compact Mirror this beautiful orange color and it's double-sided so you have the magnifying mirror on one side and it is really beautiful look at the shine on the outside i love this color Let's see what else we have in here we have the nail file and it's also in that same orange color And then we have the makeup brush. Now, this color is not really pronounced orange. This is, um, they. this came in a collection of a variety of colors, probably about maybe seven or eight different colors. But this one is called the Premier Dom. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, but it's orange to me. And it comes with this beautiful leather Chanel case. And on the inside, We have three brushes. We have a nice, well, that's soft, a nice fluffy powder brush. Then we have this foundation brush. And then this one is an eyeshadow brush. Oh, and it's dual ended. So let's see. And it's retractable. So we have the dual ended retractable eyeshadow brush and it's very soft too so this is very nice because i think just for the brushes that they retail for about 160 dollars for for these three brushes and the mirror is about 45 dollars for the mirror and i think 30 dollars for the nail file so this came in a set and i want to say it's been a minute but i want to say i paid maybe $210 for the kit. I really can't, I can't remember, but I believe that it's a good deal when you purchase it in the set like this. And then this case is perfect for travel. If you don't want to use it for these brushes, you can always put like maybe um, lip liners or lip gloss. It may even, depending on your perfume, you may even can fit like a, maybe a travel some travel perfumes in here but this is leather and it is very nice and it's the color that i love so and i have one chanel brush a foundation brush that's retractable and it is like by far my best brush that i have so i'm really excited and can't wait to use these brushes and hopefully they um work just as well as the other one that i have but this is from the color code selection i don't know if they still have these now because like i said it's been a minute since i purchased them so now we're going to get right into my other unboxing okay so this next item that i have is also from chanel and the box is pretty big so i've already opened the box and i'm just going to pull it out and show you what it is that i have and it is the deville tote bag in the small size now this is a bag that has been on my radar for quite some time. Um, I saw lots of different colors of this bag and so I was going back and forth for quite a while of what color I would want to get this bag in. And I never really thought that I wanted it in black. At first I thought gray, but then when I saw the gray, I wasn't too thrilled about it. And this is something that I would be using for maybe travel, 
Um, it's small enough that I can use every day if I have some large items that I want to tote around or, you know, just a bag to throw some things in for, you know, an outing. So when I saw the black, I thought, well, maybe the black would be best because also it would hide, you know, if I got any stains on it because this bag does not have any feet on the bottom. So that was my main thing was getting something dark enough to wear it if something gets on it is not too noticeable so i actually picked this purse up on my birthday and my birthday was in september <laughs> but i just had not put it out of the bag yet but i am happy that i have this bag and as you can see i have not carried it so i'm going to go ahead and unbox everything so we can get a good idea of how it's working here and the size maybe you know, I'll come back and I'll do a what fits inside of this bag because it is pretty roomy because on the inside it's just all open space I love that it has this also this chain strap so I can put it on my shoulder I can carry it in my hand I just love it, it needs to be versatile so and I did pick this up at the Chanel Boutique inside of Saks Fifth Avenue. Let's see here. And the hardware on this is a, a light gold hardware. So you can see it's all black. That light gold hardware on it. I just think this is the perfect size if you want to carry a tote bag on a daily. Um, you can put it on your arm, but I really love it. This is the inside. The inside is nice and roomy. You have a zipper pocket on the side, and then you also have two side pockets where you can put maybe your cell phone or some other items here on the side. There you go. One is larger than the other, but very roomy. And then you have the zipper pocket over here on that side. And then it also comes with a pouch, which is, let's see if it's, it's also a detachable pouch on the inside. And that is also pretty roomy. So you can keep your miscellaneous items in here. You can put your earbuds, um, your keys, makeup, any small items into this. And if you want to, you can use this inside another handbag I always love when you can get like something extra along with the bag so that really gives a nice incentive to want to buy the bag when you get a little extra that you can use outside of using it with this bag so I'm very happy that I was able to pick this up in the black and I know that I'm going to get a lot of use out of it now that I've opened it, this is probably be something that I would probably grab for on a daily. And now that it's fall time too. So this is the Chanel DeVille in the black. The only thing I think is probably, it'll probably collect a lot of lint, but that's nothing that a lint brush won't take care of. And that is all that I have for you today. So I'm going to try to upload a video at least once a week. For those of you who are new to my channel, please make sure you like, subscribe, comment. If you have the DeVille in another color, let me know how you enjoy yours and what color do you have in the comments below. And I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.